Survivors of southeastern Turkey's devastating earthquakes six months ago are now grappling with a new hardship, severe water shortages. Water supplies were first damaged by the quakes, but the current heat wave is making it worse. I'm in Antakya, one of the cities worst hit by the quakes. It's been scorchingly hot here in recent weeks with temperatures up to 40 degrees Celsius. And many people here tell me one of their main concerns right now is water. We saw earthquake survivors forming long queues while aid workers distributed bottled water. Experts say many water and sewage pipes were damaged either by the quakes or the ongoing demolition work that followed and that tap water could still be contaminated. That's why people have to rely on deliveries of bottled water. And the lack of water is fueling health concerns. Susuzluğun birçok sorunu var. Kalp damar hastalıklarının kötüye gitmesine kadar, böbrek hastalıklarının ilerlemesine kadar, böbrek enfeksiyonları, e, bazen yazın e, sıcak çarpmaları oluyor. E, su yoksa hijyen de yok. Bu sefer ne olacak? Hijyenle gelen enfeksiyonlarla karşılaşmış olacağız. Doctors are calling for more urgent efforts to repair water pipes and for drinking water deliveries to be stepped up. In many parts of Antakya, rubble is still piling high, as you can see, six months on from the disaster. The quakes in early February were the most deadly and destructive in modern Turkish history. They affected 11 Turkish provinces. More than 50,000 people were killed, according to official figures. Hundreds of thousands are still displaced, living in container cities or in makeshift tent camps, reliant on aid, including bottled water.